Bro, I am so sick of this country's bullshit. Pretty much every single one of my pants is developing a rip, you know, right where all the chafe happens, right? Even though this is supposed to be the stretchy material so that that doesn't happen, but that happens. But that's beside the point, right? So last year, because, you know, I get these types of pants because this is, like, the dress code for my job, you know? And it's that perfect stretchy material, so, like, you know, for those of us that are dummy thick, we're, you know, it's more comfortable. Anyways, I got these types of pants thinking, oh, I'm a contractor. This will be a tax write-off, right? Especially since I don't go anywhere or do anything, really, because everything's so goddamn christing expensive, you know? Why the fuck wouldn't it be a tax write-off? So anytime they ripped, I'd just save my receipts, and I'd be like, okay, well, you know, I don't have the skills to sew this, and my mother actually has sewn these before for me, and it's worked fine, but it's tight, and then, you know, it proceeds to rip again. I'm not saying her sewing skills aren't stellar, but, like, after another year or so, they rip again, so, like, you know what I mean? It's just a poor quality material, but... It's not actually a tax write-off, like I thought it was. Like, I went to H&R Block, talked to a couple different people, they're like, yeah, it's a tax write-off, you're good. Because, you know, it's for my job, I'm a contractor, this is for my job. And then, fucking, I go to the one person at H&R Block, and they're like, nope, it's not a tax write-off. And this ends up being the person that actually does my taxes. So, the fucking shoes I got for work... The shirts, the pants, all that shit, right? Apparently it's not a tax write-off. And I'm like, dude, if I'm going to be going through this shit, literally keeping this country running, I'm not allowed to talk about what I do for a living because, you know, I signed a contract with my boss. But believe me, I literally keep this country running. If I stop doing what I fucking do, I promise you, there would probably be global, like, it wouldn't affect everything, but people around the world would notice. Stock prices would change. Shit like that. You know what I mean? I'm not super important. That's not what I'm saying. But my job and the people I work for, it's decently important. You know what I mean? And then along comes the fucking IRS and H&R Block saying this shit isn't a tax write-off. So I'm like, dude, I don't even want to fucking spend money on pants, you know? Like, this shit's fucked up, and it's gonna keep getting fucked up. Because, I mean, I guess I'm just gonna keep wearing it. Like, what else am I gonna do, you know? I mean, probably try and get it stitched or repaired to make it last as long as humanly possible. But it's like, dude, <laughs> I'm literally here keeping the wheels of industry turning. You know what I mean? And they can't even do me a solid and be like, yeah, yeah, we'll comp your fucking $120 worth of pants, right? It's like, dude, what the fuck? And, like, I don't know. So, and here's my thing, right? Here's my thing. So if I get, like, a printer or a new computer or a Bluetooth headset or, you know, a piece of technology that can benefit my job, they're like, yeah, sure, go right on ahead, right? Which is interesting because, like, you know, you'd think pants and clothing, which is necessary where I work, would also be, you know, you know what I mean? Like, how is a new computer, which I, I actually do need, this fucking thing is getting, I don't know, I feel like the computers lately have been going to shit, like, my school computers used to last me literally throughout school, you know, and then I get a new fucking whatever, and it starts shitting itself, and I'm updating it, I'm keeping, I'm doing all that shit, it's just, you know, it's going to shit for some reason, I don't know why, same with the pants, you know, like, they used to make products that would actually fucking last for an amount of time, and then... Now, it's like, okay, well, the products aren't lasting. I need 
more of said product, you know, but I can't even use it as a tax write-off, which is fucking, just fucking ridiculous, in my opinion, you know, because <laughs> I work with sharp metal, there could be fucking sparks, actually I work with a lot of sharp metal, and a lot of what I do is walking around sharp metal, in between sharp metal, sharp plastic, you know, like, I need to protect my goddamn legs, and, you know, and they're just like, nope, not a tax write-off, what the fuck is that, how is this not a tax write-off, you know, like, I can keep using the same piece of shit computer until it literally shits itself and I'm forced to get a new one, and that's a tax write-off, right, why not the pants, why not the clothing, you know what I mean, Literally everything is so expensive, I can barely afford to go out once or twice a month to go see a movie or some shit, you know? Which is amazing. I mean, I'm glad that we're just fucking shoveling our money into Israel and Ukraine. I'm so happy about that. I mean, you know, that's just, that's amazing. I love to see my tax dollars, which is significant, by the way, extremely significant, like, they tax the shit out of me. They tax the shit out of me. And here I am, fucking walking around with my balls hanging out of these goddamn things, because, you know, this isn't a tax write-off. Dude, it needs to be a tax write-off. What the hell is this? What is this? Why is this? Why is this not a tax write-off, you know? the fucking car shits itself, I need the car to get to work, I need the car for my job driving around between facilities, you know what I mean? That's a tax write-off. Why is this not a tax write-off, you know? I use this every day just like I use the fucking car, just like I use the phone, just like I use the technology for my job, but this shit is not a tax write-off, you know? So it's like, dude, that's fucking insane. That is insane. Like, they're, they don't make any sense to me. And I'm, I'm getting real sick of their bullshit. So, you know, if anyone wants to revolt, I'm with you.